was 15, I was playing football, and uh, I was a quarterback, and uh, I don't remember any of it, but uh, I just got three or four concussions in one game. Jared was playing quarterback, and it was the third quarter, and he got hit at helmet to helmet straight in the front and in his temple area, and he went down and it took a little bit to get him back up. The uh, next play, they snapped the ball to him and it went past, just right past him. Well, he got hit helmet to helmet again. So they did a little exam on him. He started having sen sensitivity to the light from the reflection off the bleachers. They took him to the emergency room. They said it was a concussion, they sent him home. I uh, was taken out of school for the rest of my sophomore year. And uh, I was just at home. I was sleeping almost, almost all day. I was sleeping about 20 hours a day. We would see doctors, and he started having episodes of syncope, and so that was scary having him pass out on me. There was a long period of time that I, I you know, I remember some things, but I don't remember everything. So I started researching because I thought there's got to be more answers than what they're giving me. So I found the Center for Brain Health on the internet and I contacted them through email. That's where we met Dr. Cook and she uh, helped a lot. And I was very kind of fragile then, you know, being around people and uh, it was very hard for me. But when I came here, it was a very comfortable environment. It's really important for us to get out this message that a concussion is truly a brain injury. Um, and that for people to really take these things seriously, not to simply discount them. We are able to take a unique stance and provide actually information that's very hopeful in the sense where brain research um, is revealing so much about the brain's remarkable capacity to heal. It's called neuroplasticity. It's, it's so moldable and changeable. And uh, this is really great news for somebody who's had a brain injury. And that was such a blessing and such a turning point for Jerry and myself because they understood exactly what he was going through and they gave me answers for what I really needed to hear as a mom because it was, it was scary. The Center for Brain Health really helped a lot. Um, they uh, definitely helped with my school and, uh, and with the social aspects and things. Uh, I don't know what I would have done without them.